So here you go. I'm sure many of you recognize this plant. This is a Yucca Ristrata. This is the, the variety known as Sapphire Skies. It's the one you see around here if they have a name attached to them. And this one went in the ground as a one gallon pot in 2019. So you can see it is definitely coming along and I would almost hazard or would say that it is trunking or on the verge of trunking. If I trimmed some of these lower leaves off, there would probably be, oh, two or three inches of trunk, maybe a little bit more. But this is a, a really easy plant to take care of. Uh, it, I wouldn't say it grows slow. I mean, it, it, it grows at a decent pace. Um, to have one with multiple feet of trunk, though, I mean, you're gonna have to wait, you know, 10 years or more. So that's kind of why they command such a high, such a high price tag. But uh, hardy into zone six for sure, maybe even to zone five. Uh, it, it, I think it would be considered the hardiest, or at least right up there uh, for the trunking yuccas. Just a really easy plant. Um, I find that they're not even too picky about clay. This one's kind of planted in, in sandy soil, so it does quite well. The other one, my trunking one, is actually not in sandy soil. It's actually like a nice loam. And I have had them in the back in the clay, but um, you know, plant them in full sun. If you don't, what happens is you don't quite get as many leaves. They, they, they don't look as filled out. So in full sun, you get this really nice, full looking kind of ball. And, and as time goes on, this thing's just gonna keep looking better and better. Uh, it's probably not gonna, well, I guess in time, it'll get a little bit wider, but it's probably gonna stay at about this width for the next while. So that is coming up on three years from a one gallon. I have a one that died back and um, it was probably quite similar to the size that this was when I planted it. I will show you, it is over here. So it might have been that big when I first put it in the ground. This one died and it sent up a new sucker so it's slowly been recovering. Anyway, thanks for watching.